this tutorial video, we will show you how to use the Stepwell Soil and Kootenai Biosoil Collaboration Grow Kit. This kit includes 127 liters or 34 gallons of SSW Super Soil, 1 pound each of Nature's Pride Veg and Bloom, Method 1 Plant Wash, and EM1 Essential Microbes. The first thing we recommend doing before transplanting any seeds or rooted clones into the soil is condition the soil by adding water and stirring it up to help decompress the soil from the bale. This will help improve in the soil's water retention. This can translate into better root growth and plant health. Choose your desired amount of soil to use. Take about 300 milliliters of water per gallon of soil used and pour it into a bucket or tub. Then stir it up for a few seconds till you get a texture similar to this. Now take your germinated seedling and transplant it into the soil. If you have a ruderalis plant, also known as an auto plant, you can transplant the seedling into a peat pellet and place the peat pellet into the SSW super soil. This is what it looks like after transplanting. We recommend starting off seedlings in one gallon sized pots so the roots do not get restricted early. Doing so can help reduce nutrient shock to the seedlings. If you're starting your clones, you can directly transplant them into the soil. At this stage, you can water the plants about 250 to 400 milliliters every few days or as the soil needs it. It's important to keep the core of the soil moist to maintain and build beneficial microbial and fungal growth. Using your essential microbes helps build your plant's immune system and at the same time keeping your soil happy with extra life added to it. Now we are going to show you how to mix the EM1 using clean water and add it to a spray bottle. We filled this bottle up to about 700 milliliters of water. Recommended dosage is about 1 to 2 milliliters per liter of water. Here we are using about 1.5 milliliters of EM1. Add it to the water and then give it a good mix. Remember to leave the concentrated EM1 in the fridge to keep the microbes dormant. The premix bottle can stay on the shelf for 4 weeks. Use the premixed EM1 to mist the surface of the soil and boiler spray fresh clones or seedlings that have grown into at least 4 to 5 nodes. Continue following these steps for weeks 1 to 2 in veg cycle. For more instructions, go to stepwellsoil.com to download the weekly grow schedule. You can purchase our grow kits on our website or find a retailer near you that carries it in store. Remember to subscribe and give us a thumbs up. We will be uploading more gardening tips and tricks. To learn about vegging weeks 3 to 4, check out part 2 of this video.